Hello again. Today we're going to be talking about using a perpendicular bisector to find the value of x. So here I have a diagram and I'm told that ray BD is the perpendicular bisector of line segment AC. So here I'm told to find x if AD is equal to x plus 20. So this is x plus 20 and CD is 50. Well, I've learned that AD is congruent to CD because this is a perpendicular bisector and point D is the same distance to A as it is to point C. So I can say that X plus 20 equals 50. And to solve for this, I would subtract 20, subtract 20, those cancel. I bring down my equal sign. I bring down the X. 50 minus 20 is 30. So X equals 30. So now I know that AD is 27 and CD is X minus 11. And I need to find the value of X. Well, I know that X minus 11 equals 27. So I will add 11 to both sides of the equation. My 11s cancel here and I'm left with X equals 38. So for this one, X equals 38. So here I'm told to find the distance between point A and point D. All right, so I need to find that distance. Well, the way I do that is I know that AD is X plus 10, so I have X plus 10, and I know that CD is 3X minus 12. I also know that those two segments are the same length, so I can set them equal to each other. So I have X plus 10 equals 3X minus 12. So I will subtract 3X on both sides of the equation, and I'm left with negative 2X plus 10 equals negative 12. Now I will subtract 10 subtract 10. Now I'm left with negative 2x equals negative 22. Well, I will divide both sides by negative 2. So that will give me x equals negative 22 divided by negative 2. So x equals positive 11. Well, I need to find the distance between point A and point D not just the value of X. And remember that AD is X plus 10. So I will put the value of X, which is 11 into that expression. So it'll be 11 plus 10 and that equals 21. So the distance from A to D is 21. And that's how you use perpendicular bisectors to find the distance between points.